Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is G. Cole, and welcome to Homegrown, where I get to share with you some good music while talking to some great people. Hello world, hope you're feeling as good as I am. I want to big up all my homegrown listeners out there and welcome all the new listeners. If you haven't yet subscribed, please do so we can keep you updated when new material is available. We will be posting new episodes bi-weekly. want to thank everyone who has been listening and sharing. Please leave us a comment, we'd love to hear from you. Please check out the website homegrownwithgcole.com to listen and for all things homegrown. The podcast is now available on iTunes, Spotify, Google Play, Stitcher, TuneIn, iHeartRadio, and all your podcast platforms. We're also very interactive. Please follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook at MyGCole. The video of this interview is also available on YouTube. Please subscribe to our Homegrown with G. Cole YouTube channel. This is episode 62, and today's guests, the legends, Tanta Metron Devante, Spraga Benz. This episode is brought to you courtesy of Aqua Gem Records' latest releases, Who Am I by Sharon Boney and World Clash by Silvadan. Aqua Gym Records is coming at you with some more brand new releases. This one is World Clash by Silverdan straight out of Israel. And another brand new release by Sharon Boney, also out of Israel. This one is called Who I Am. International reggae at its finest, ladies and gentlemen. Aqua Gem Records presents Silver Don and Sharon Boney. Brand new tunes available on iTunes and all your digital retailers. Yo, on the road. You say she'll request it. Ooh, yeah, man, let's see if it. She can't get away. Could never, could never. Uh-uh. No. Give it to her heart. More when needed. You know, time to mention Devante. Uh-huh. Oh. Listen up. She said she wanted she said she need Rachel, welcome. Yeah. She said she Nadine, what up? Got the UK, got California in the building. You to, you listen, iTunes, and iTunes go get, go get the thing that you know I mean. Microphones open, Tanta Metro, Devante, Sprague Benz, welcome to the program, gentlemen. Everything is everything. Yeah, yeah man. Respect our man. Cool, man. I know it's on up and down and up on the road for the longest, so we're not keeping it too long. Come and know so the artists them need to get the rest up and get ready for tonight. All right. But and I had Tanta Metro in here the other night, so we had a long convo. Yeah. Devante, we didn't get to chop it up with you. You know what I mean? So all of the things about Tanta Metro tell me we're, we're not true. We didn't get that, 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 that. You know what I mean? We didn't get a chance to clarify with you. True, true. You know true. what I mean? And you know how he do. No, 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 no. no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's our last week on the link up. Our last week. <laughs> we just know him. <laughs> Brother, let me ask you this because I'm not in the business for a minute. Anytime we get the opportunity to talk to the legends, all right? And of course, you guys are in the trenches doing what you do. So a lot of time, Uno no look on it as legends because it's not a day at the office for now. <laughs> but for me, y'all are legendary in the game, right? Yeah, yeah, respect that, man. Trust me, brother. I'm putting the work, putting the time, putting the yeah. effort. You started out doing this from back in the day, doing what you do. Like I'd ask him, when you dropped the first tune as Tanta Metro and Devante, 97. right? 97. Mm. Right now, we're not 2019. Did you have any idea that we'd be here 2019 talking about Tanta Mitchell and Devante as legends in that business? Well, you see, when we are coming at the business, mm-hmm. we're coming at it with a open head for anything happen. Right. You understand? So, personally, when I, I do music, I think there's no limit to what I do. Mm. And the always think big, you know? Right. If you think smaller than all you ever think, then it's not going to work. Ah. 
So we don't know where the journey might take us. Right, right. But from it take us down this road, and we'll, we'll just show yes, sir. gratitude. I feel you. I feel you. Yeah, man. So we give thanks for the, the mileage. We get out tight and because we put a lot of hard work in it still. Yeah. Yeah, man. I always talk them lines because something that eludes artists and when I drop nothing but nowadays artists is this thing called longevity. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, it's almost a disposable vibe where let's create this music for today and if we can't get it for last till Friday, we're good. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But people aren't necessarily pre and focus as much as they should on the long term. And maybe they are. You know what I say? But it's just the way the music set up and so forth. So that's why I always get to the one day. Sprague Benz. Yeah. What are going on that day? You're good? Yeah, man. All right. Well, here's the thing, though. A long time, as I, as I sit down and talk to you guys in the building, you know, it's like, it's like, it's like for me, take me back to when we did a certain place in time and who me I get a one wine from a certain tune. Uh, 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 I, go on, I go on a certain way, you know what I mean? <laughs> Ain't no shame in my game. She married now, but me married too. We're straight. <laughs> Equal. Equal. Equal to you. Samantha, thank you. Honorable work, one brother. Go ahead and share the link. We're going to have a vibe this evening. All right, let me say iTunes. I'm going to iTunes. Great. I'm not spoiling nobody in here tonight. Sprague events. Yeah. Tanto Metro and Devante, they, they, they're a duo, they are a group. They've been doing that together for mm. a hot minute, all right? You're a solo artist, but you've had your fair share of some heavy, heavy, heavy collabs, right? Mm. And I've seen people do it. Many have tried and failed. So obviously, two people get in the studio and jump on a microphone is not the formula. You understand yeah. me, I say? Yeah. From your opinion, what's the formula for, 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 for a proper collaboration? You're a solo, they're my solo artist. How do you make it work and generate Chemistry. hits? Chemistry. Yeah, chemistry is just a variety, you know? Yeah. Energy for the day. Yeah. Aside from that, you have a, a big label that spend a big budget where I just force it through. Mm. <laughs> you know, some love that talk there because some people avoid, we, 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 we try to go the organic road yeah. and make it sound like, say, boy, everything, if you plant this seed and you put some water on it and you mm. put some, nobody want to get deal and say, yo, some money I have to spend it now. Yeah. But yeah. as long as the chemistry, right, then, yeah. you know, the artists and collaborate and everything just, you know, magical. Mm -hmm. Like even for some young ladies, uh, mm -hmm. we're not a group or a deal, but the two of us have a chemistry and we come to the studio and we never need no label for spending money behind it. Mm. But we work with other artists and we sign to labels and them say, yeah, you know, this person is so good and they put us together and uh, to the label have to spend and it's still not reach where mm. another thing would have reached, you know. So the chemistry have to right. The chemistry are the main, major ingredient. Yeah. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, another question, and this is a question where, where, where believe it or not, look up early another week, I say, you know, so I can talk to Spraga, I ask these people no questions, you know, they might tell me them questions, can you find this, can you ask this for me? So, I'm going to ask you this, in the streets right now, 2019, mm. who hot in the streets? Spraga Benz or Wayne from Shatters? <laughs> <laughs> what the bud? I like that. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to Spraga Benz, man. <laughs> Most Spraggabins. Yeah, that's Spraggabins. <laughs> Spraggabins. <laughs> Just remember to talk to Paul Campbell, the actor one yeah. time. I said, something, you play a character so yeah. well that when yeah. I'm seeing at the streets, yeah. are you, are we in that, you know? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying? Yeah. And Spraga that character. Same way, man. I, I Spraga lead the thing. Same way. Same. Just like, without Spraga, we ain't, we ain't gonna cut it. No, I'm gonna wait. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. Classics. So when I say classics, I talk about classic songs and even coming yeah. over to, to, to acting to the big screen and, and I make classic works. I love that. Give thanks. No limitations to what we do. No, I You know what I mean? Birthday boy, Tanto, yeah. Metro. Yeah. I said, God, like I said, me ain't talk for a long time. I'm gonna ask you something. Where people them in store for a little more? For a treat. Yeah. <clears throat> you know? Performing and you don't know, we love we love relate back of you know our performance to people to to fans them and, and feel a part of what we're doing now mm. because of we are I entertain we love we just have just a sing so and mm. I talk to them we just you know we interact mm. with everybody tonight yeah give them a night nice, nice water cake they they feel me already yeah. we are going there early go go just go do get that part out of the way yeah I make any anybody just eat cake yeah. And drink them juice and enjoy themselves and nice. So yeah. we have, you know, as, as you can see, Spraga in the house and Yellowstone and yeah. the whole crew. Everybody is here now. So we just, oh, we just in for them. Just in for a nice street tonight, you know. Is a cake gluten free? You know, so I'll have to and everything with it. Nah, man, you're <laughs> yeah, man. Everybody <laughs> eat cake, man. Yeah, <laughs> 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 I'm 
Yeah. Cool, I love it, I love it, I love it. And you got the young gun, Yellowstone over there, so that's, 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 you know, coming out on a stage right now with the biggest of the... Oh. Again, I said this with no apologies. And I think sometimes only in the trenches on the realize. And a lot of time the general public too, you don't realize you don't realize the, the, the magnitude of an artist catalog until it's time for sit down with them. Because you gotta go through that catalog. You know what I mean? Right now, we, we, we technically have legendarily two entities and a brand new artist. And right now, Metal say I had to go through about fifty churn for fine three. I'm, and, and, and there's a word that I left out at the 50 tune, 50 big tune for fine three. You know what I mean? So for a young artist like that coming up, Devante, I'm going to swing it over to you. You know what I mean? Sometimes them say the youth, them they like take advice, I'm like heed this or not, but not this one here, so he's willing to learn. All right? On this longevity train, if you have to drop some words of advice for Yellowstone, what would that be? Pay attention to the business. Mm-hmm. If you pay attention, you'll fall upon the wayside. Mm. Always know, say, where you want, you're going, you get it, you know. Mm-hmm. And then mm-hmm. everything will give you thanks. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. Yeah, man. If you just believe in yourself. Yeah. Confidence is king. Yes, man. If you don't believe in it, no, go nowhere. Mm. Focus. I love it. I love yeah. it. I love it. No, focus, focus, focus. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And the artists are going about out the road, you have some tunes out like uh, no, 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 that no, one. No, no, no. Me, I try to keep the peace. I try to fight the police. When me step out on them, no talking again. No why hear nothing to that for our friend. When me step out on them, you know that at the end, cause we no make trouble. My own me a defend. When me step out on them, that means I'm a friend. And Mr. iTunes, all right. So if all the songs that you were dropping little snippets of right now up on iTunes, and I go get them, and I go get them, and I get them. Spraga. When, 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 when you just come out, I think the first tune you do was a, 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 like a, a, a bad man tune, a gun tune, that's so. all. Jack it up. Jack it up. After the first one, you do period. Mm-hmm. Jack it up by your first tune, so your first tune is it. Your first song, jack it up, jack it up, jack it up. Digo, yeah. Are you first tune that? Yeah. Cool, no man. I thought that was, I mean, I didn't say first tune that. Because when we talk to the, here, here's the thing. You're an artist like this now, and um, you don't get uncomfortable. The ladies are watching. You know what I mean? You do your thing. Couple of ladies, me tell us, are going to the building, and I say, Yeah, I'm not that me. I tell them that tomorrow, it's another day today, but we just now have the room in the building, <laughs> you know what I mean? So, and them, them say, Yeah, 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 and I'm gonna ask questions, and I'm asked about 10 questions before they get to music. So, it comes down to, to realize that you are the girl, them DJ, you understand me? When and, and, and I've spoken to other artists who say, like, there's a formula to music and to success and to songs getting hits and who you're targeting. Them said about you have bad man tune, but that's not necessarily commercial, that's not necessarily a sell. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And they have the girl them tune. Is this a formula that you figured out early in your career? Or is it just Asperga Benza? To do what? For, for sing for the ladies. Because you have an arsenal of songs them where are, are, are the girl them you're you, you, you targeting yeah. to. You yeah, love one man. Yeah, but in terms of putting them songs out, I know yeah, say them songs. Yeah, sing where them, where, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. It's as a natural thing. Yeah. Do you find that that leads more down the lane of success than, than, than let's say, a, a bad man tune or a gangster tune? I don't nah really watch success in a brother. Mm-hmm. When I make music come love, I like to sing them and that's it for me. I said, I'm get to perform them and fans them appreciate it. Mm. That's successful to me. Mm. So success is relative. Yes. What it means to you, it means to that other brother. Exactly. I dig that. I dig that, I dig that, I dig that. And Marie, may I ask you a question, all right? Low me. <laughs> All right, the artists I'm in that building, and again, we have legends, we got a healthy catalog, some of us have skipped through some things, so nobody uh-huh. feel yeah. left out, you know what I mean? Yaka, yaka. Yalla one man in a yalla. Don't make them know, they better know, uh-huh. Yalla say woe, he, I can't show you say I'm a master. When they make his skin go, I say woe, he, I can't show you say I'm a master. Yalla say woe, he, I can't show you say I'm a master. You know some time people, I say woe, he, Devante, I, I, like I said, I had a lengthy conversation with no. Tanto Metro the other night. I'm, I'm a talk to Yellowstone and stuff for, for a good minute. So that's yeah, man, I, kinda, I, I you know? the platform now, you know. Yeah, so I give him the, the, yeah, the man, thing, you know. Yeah, Make him go on, good. do him thing. Um, I got the history, of course, from Tanto. 
Right now, I sat down, let me tell him, I sat down with Bobby Digital Dixon a couple months ago, and we talked to the family. Like, what's the difference between today versus then, right? And I realized you're one of the artists that come up as a sound system singer, too. You just sing with the sound, you know Same. what I mean? Same. How valuable is that? How much preparation did that get you? Because what he was saying, and you can correct me if I'm wrong, is right now you have formulas where people are trying to create something at the studio and figure out how it's going to connect with the dance. When another time that you create it in the dance hall, I sing for the people him, and then you figure out how it works, so you're going to the studio to record it. Yeah. Was that a big benefit to you that you think that had any contribution to your success right about now, the fact that you started out singing for the sound system? Well, basically, yeah, because you're basically... If you go in at the dance and interact with the people, so you feel the vibes there, the whole vibration there with them, them bring. Mm -hmm. And when you take it in at the studio, it's like you, you want to please them. Yeah. You make it for them. Yeah. Because you don't feel the vibes already in at the dance. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You understand? Mm -hmm. So it's kind of different when it's fabricated in at the studio. They don't really know where I go on. So they might think, well, I want if. Because before we make music, mm -hmm. we want to know what they go want. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So we look for observing. You know? Right, right, right. You understand? We observe and see what the crowd is. It's come like when Tammy and Tanto go in a stage show. Mm -hmm. We sit down and we read the audience first before we really go out there and greet them. Because mm -hmm. you have to know where you go to. Mm -hmm. you know so you're not locked away in the green room and at the back now, no, I go out the front. No, no. Well, for, um, so my time I peep through the door. Mm -hmm. Tanto go out go mingle. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, man. So what? Yeah. You have to know where I go on. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, I got you. There, there's. I feel sometimes that you now we always say nothing is new, nothing is new under the sun. No, it's not under the sun. Right, it's, come a, back it's a around. cycle. Yeah, man. And um, right now everybody's goal, as you talk to the young artists, I'm coming up is, all right, can I, can I, can I get on the hip hop flow? Can I link up with the hip hop artists? Can I cross over into the hip hop market? But and, and and they make it seem like it's a new thing. But Sprugger, you can correct me if I'm wrong. I feel like you conquered a globe there. A long, long, long time ago. And I, the, the, the reason why I ask the questions I ask is because I have a lot of musicians, a lot of up-and-coming artists and producers and so forth that watch the show, mm -hmm. right? In, 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 your, in, in the way you do what you do, how much of it is, I just sprag I do him, how much of it is just is, is calculation, like sitting down like, okay, this is a business and we got to do this this way? 99% of it is just sprag I do him thing. Yeah. As I said, it's not a business for me, it's just a hobby. Mm. So if I enjoy what I do, I do it. True. So you do what you love and it just happens to be successful. Yeah. Same Mad. sentiments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Because what you say, if, 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 if you don't love it, you know, I do it. You know, I do it. Yeah. It's way more than okay. I dig that. I dig that, ladies and gentlemen. And again, like me say, healthy catalogs out of road right about now. The artists them have no idea which tune we are play because it's fun for me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> me I forget some from entertainment or that thing too. When I go sing one and sing like more, me I play more and play now. <laughs> So watch it, boom. We don't care to feed them and those. Oh, we don't like it. If a bit of a parasite and we don't like it. They are mad as man and we stop and we don't like it. Niggas when they overhype, for see where you're... Rupi, bless up yourself. I bet you never find me no like it. Watch it, boom, and start a light and we don't like it. Feel like we prefer night and we don't like it. Girl, I come in and we sight and they may be full of strike. Girl, we ugly like a bright night, but we like it. Girl, we keep this up in tight, yes. Where were you when you heard this tune about? In a jungle like we overlike. Empress Unique, bless up, thanks for watching. When I freak that fan, the mic, yes, we like. When them carry a fan, the mic, and we like. When they do a when she take a hike, that freak no fish here overnight. Hey, to the way we go on, y'all say we sex crazy. Levante. Yes, sir. Again, when, when, I, when, I, when I skip out the part of the, 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 the music that is relevant for us, we have a find a way to get this out there to the masses. Right now we sit down and I hear people come on here and them, them complain a lot. The business, the business, the business, how the music are going, the people might take over with music and right, 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 right. You start your label a couple years ago, mm. right? Um, which I think is a brilliant thing to do. In this day and age, you have artists who reach a certain age and a certain point in their career and have no control over publishing, come find out right about now, say, they don't have no publishing. You understand me, I say? See. Um, how important was that for you for the side say I can start a label so you can actually and, and, and the second part of that question pretty much is this do you have intentions for take on artists young artists upcoming artists because I see you work with some big names in terms of put out music but see. do you have any intention to take on like young artists to your label well as I said it, it, in, it is important for me to control my own domain mm -hmm. you understand 
it is very important to control my own life. And you have to know what you are doing in the business. You have to know where you are go. Because mm -hmm. sometimes when you see where you come from, you don't really want to go back there. Mm -hmm. So you have to set the foundation, mm -hmm. and trot the path. You understand? Mm -hmm. So it was very important for me to start organize my life. Mm -hmm. As I said, we've seen producer did something we were not too pleased with. Mm -hmm. And in order to not make that mistake again, mm -hmm. we had to move and set up what's right. different. Yeah, well, as I said, if I look in the future for take on other artists, I've, I've done that before. Mm -hmm. I was responsible for some career, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. You have one named Javada now, mm -hmm. I don't know if you know the name. You know, so yeah. And I've done some stuff with Yellowstone, as I can see. Right, right. Seeing so. But we're not taking on too much, because we're artists and we have our own career. Yeah. So we have to focus on it, so we can't lose our path, we can't lose our way. Yeah. But we still have to aid the one who need the guidance there. And as long as I can extend that, a version of me there, mm -hmm. is that I will. I, you understand? I, I believe in our growth, in our anything. And I like to see success in our anything and everyone. Mm -hmm. So if, if we make you grow to be a better man, mm -hmm. or to be a better person, or a better artist, yeah. from I have the channel for do it, I'm going to do it for you. Right, I'm right. happy about it too. I dig that. Yeah, man. I dig that, I dig that, I dig that. Spraga, you spend a lot of your career traveling the globe and, and, and share your, your, your music with the masses, them, right? Mm -hmm. That's why we create this thing. We don't, we don't create it for keeping our backyard, right? Share it with the world. But our, um, you know, people always talk about the appreciation and, and how it's received and so forth. You've, you've been on the biggest stages in Jamaica. You've been on the biggest stages across the globe. How is the reception? People talk about how differently people receive music internationally versus when you're in Jamaica. When you create music, do you do you do you focus on that any at all in terms of how music is received in Jamaica versus how it's received across across the globe? Yeah, we focus on how it's received in Jamaica first, and then anybody else can follow after that. Mm. <laughs> yeah. So if them if them appreciate the yard, it's highly likely. Yeah, yeah. I most in the most because sometimes I make some songs, but I'm not even really want the rest of the world to really understand how I follow too much. Mm -hmm. So you know, I really don't want people that I talk to in other songs. So we really. Do it in such a way where we don't compromise for nothing at all mm -hmm. with the delivery. Mm -hmm. So if you're on a party, you're not even going to get it. Cool now. Cool now. Cool now. So in other words, then you create some music for your people. And if, if, if other people appreciate it, then that's great. Yes. But really and truly, I'm yeah. a people them. Yeah. May, may, yeah. May I create it for? First and foremost. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Because you want to, um, again, most of what I ask people when they come in the room is based on conversations. I talk about music. and Maybe I talk about music too much. You know what I mean? Sometimes I'm there, I'm I know my wife would have hope and pray so I'm going to talk about something else. But unfortunately, I saw the thing go. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm a big fan of music. I'm a big consumer of music. And I tell you, say, these again, we're sitting down, we're talking to the artists who have done it and done it well. Now, you've had that, again, almost like a hip-hop, really a relationship with the hip-hop community. I see a lot of people right now focused on the flow, right? Um, I think how people talk about is there any substance in the music I feel like right now we're the most lyrical we've ever been everybody's focused on lyrics to the point where it can be a bit much sometimes you know what I'm saying how important is lyricism I, I, I see a lot of people say I'm a lyricist but I think they're wordsmiths wordsmiths mean they can put two words together and they sound clever mm -hmm. they really mean too much you know but mm -hmm. it's dope you know what I'm saying but lyricists you listen to the lyrics and it'll paint the picture for you how important is it for people to work on lyricism versus just I'm just a wordsmith I'm just a clever dude well if you want to make sense if you want to construct a, 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 a essay or a composition mm -hmm. then you have to be a lyricist you know if you want to construct something that people can follow from start to finish from A to B and everything connect all of the dots them. Right. but if you just arrive right and say yeah my heart tip black cause you don't know some work out the street and stop a shop <laughs> 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 yeah. I swear they got that tomorrow yeah cause you stop a shop and, black yeah. and all of them rhyme there and scheme you know yeah. wordsmith thing already but you know yeah. it can put together more thoroughly that it make perfect sense that somebody can listen it and follow like a storyline mm -hmm. good boy living on a fun thing you know I'm not time for a laugh and a grin serious when you deal with a gun thing make up your mind for bun boy skin all of them lines uh, are real things that, where you live by you know mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. lyricism you see me so that is not just a, a word to rhyme up some things that had, that had some conscious mm -hmm. constructive things in that, in that way you know people yeah. can grab some, some substance from yeah 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 I dig it, I dig it. And, and primarily why I may ask it, I had a conversation, I get me talk about music too much. I had a conversation with somebody the other day who 
them they make it sound like yo this lyricism thing a today thing and this kind of hip hop thing I got um, and and I literally did exactly what I could do right about now and say so um so what I'm to uh, what, what, what I'm to what I'm to yeah it's all about the reason and so uh, how we have sex style? Long time in a fear, where did the star? So everything crystal, are you just passing on a crystal? So you think this star what? Let me up with that sister, make me for the show star. Shove a man on up, leave in the cold star. Then we could have switched star, man, don't know. She give me some of that to me, make she give some of this star. Come and love for this star. Love make them do some bliss star, cause you don't know, man, I'm on star. Look up to the rock stuff, man, I got stuff. All right, all right, all right, all right. So that, first of all, that's my favorite Sparkle Brand show. Everybody yeah. have them, that one there, my favorite. Based on the delivery and the whole nine. At the time when that song came out, but they're watch a race, I watch him come from. I'm mm-hmm. going to disc and that, I'm going to buy it. That's one of the first. That's probably the second dance album. I'm going spend my own money on. It was fully loaded. It was, um, yeah, fully loaded. Mm-hmm. Right, Rona? You know them, you know what it is. Yeah. So I'm going to buy that. And that was the song that I repeated pretty much over and over and over and over again. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to catch a delivery, I'm going to try to do it on talent show. It never worked out. You know? <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm going to catch a delivery, I'm going to try to do it on talent show. It never worked out. You know? And then I'm going to catch a delivery, I'm going to try to do it on talent show. It never worked out. You know? It never worked out too well, you know what I mean? But it's all good. A long time, a long time, a long time. Now, that said to me from way back then that lyricism was important. It's not something new. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. A long time, things and people are construct things a certain way where not only is it catchy, not only it's amazing how the word play goes and how it comes together, but it's a vivid, clear story. Yeah. Now, when I ask an artist like yourself is this, you have artists out there who are just creative energies. You know what I mean? We have imagination. We can make up some things. I have some people who lie for their muse. Whatever them got you, probably they end up on the album. You know what I mean? Are you that person where whatever Spraga Benz got you, you know what I mean? Spraga of a girl and, and it don't work out. She might be track nine on the next album. No. No? None at all. <laughs> Is it not worth that way there? Not that way at all. <laughs> might, might talk about other experiences that people might can learn from, mm-hmm. but my personal experiences and anything that. You're not good at No, you're not good at so. And talk from imagination and observation mm-hmm. and things that you, you assessment. Mm-hmm. But you know, really put your lifestyle in it like that unless there's some inspiration you try to transfer. Ah, I got it, I got it, I got it. And I'm going to throw this to the two on it. How is it? Again, at 2019, we're not right about now. Everybody's got a phone, right? Personally, me feels everybody have a camera and somebody camera them can make a call, right? That's, that's what they are. How do you manage in this day and age to live a normal life? Because me not see sparring in the tabloids. Me not see tantometra and devant in the tabloids. How do you manage to live your life them kind of way there and, and, and you know, live a, a, a fruitful life, enjoy your life without being in the tabloids day in, day out? Well, we just have a thing named, you see, a thing named privacy. Mm-hmm. And I really, really, really look on it deeply still. Mm-hmm. What I want the media to see, I show them that. But them now, but me now want them to see. Mm-hmm. They keep it out of them eyesight. Right. Understand? So right. It's very important. But privacy is my personal life. It's my personal life. Mm-hmm. You understand? And when it come on to music, then I think it's supposed to know about we. Mm-hmm. And that is what we put out there. You right. Understand? That is what's supposed to be in right. the public eyes. Other so what, that, what about the concept of every publicity is good publicity? No, me not believe in that. Yeah. But me believe say publicity is good. Mm-hmm. But not everything. Mm. You need some privacy, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even a little. Mm. Mm. I dig that, Spraga. Yeah. How, 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 how you manage it? Me live my own life, you know, but I'm in a business with people. <laughs> Most of the time when me step somewhere, by the time me gone, them just even realize that. So you did it. I'm going to walk with the hype, I'm going to carry it, I'm going to lift it. You're floating and float out. Yeah, yeah. yeah music. My music for talk for me, or, or my works. Mm. So, yeah, mm. and that means believe, you know. I dig it. Yeah. I dig it. I dig it. Which song can you not go on a stage and come off and do if, it, if people not riot? Which which Spraga Ben song if you left off of that stage eh, and, and don't think, perform yeah, that? I hope for you watch it. No man. <laughs> it's if you left off and do that. Yeah, that. I worry. Mm-hmm. If I come off and I sing hype up. Yeah. You can't go on that, did it? No, I get attacked. <laughs> 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 and I tell you, ask him for call your hand back. You know, the car. For real, 20 years or more, and I still yeah. want to ladies and favorite song. Mm. Mm. I don't know, everyone yeah. falls in love with like. Yes, it is. Yeah. Favorite, you, you can't know? come yeah. on. No, no, you know what I'm saying? The story not done if it doesn't. Not done yet. Yeah. yeah. Sure, not done. Yeah. Sure, not done. <laughs> Yeah, no matter yeah. sometimes I try to mm. go around it and say, mm. 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 I sing that song every show. Trying to like boats in the man. 
<laughs> it's how went on to the day. still expect you to sing a DJ. Oh, you mean? <laughs> Just deal with it, too, because I'm bad with you. It's a DJ. You teach him. Yeah, you know I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I know it. I think him know it. <laughs> cool, the man. I thought the words are come out. That's what the thing said. That's what it come, man. That's, what, that's what I'm telling you. I'm feeling well tonight, you know. They're feeling bad for me. A good boy, you know. A good boy. Don't a good boy, man. You just want to care. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You have on your, you have on your, your earpiece, seeing? Yeah. If, if me going in your thing and looking at your playlist, what, 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 what Spraga vibe out to? Spraga music. Yeah. Yeah. It's a vibe out to some, some brand new Spraga, when we want to hear it. Some things that I work on. Because so much music, you know what I mean? I'm mad at it. Not even your quiet out of music. I'm ready for singing yet, I put out to them. Yeah. Yeah, so I always have to listen back to myself because I don't want to sound like that. I don't want that. Infiltrating in your meds, you know, you know them where mm-hmm. just basically staying on my zone, staying on my lane, listen to myself and listen to beats. Mm. If my brethren them put out an album now, I something I them send something I said, DJ, give me a feedback on this, then I get a hundred percent I can me have to give back a feedback to my brethren and a direction or something. Mm-hmm. But other than that, me just focus on my works, brother. Mm, yeah. I love that, I love that. That we're gonna get this way, they're gonna get influenced around we are whatever. Where are you man yeah. being? No, when we go dance, me hear everybody music. Yeah, 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 yeah. When we work, I listen to, if you listen to, even when we drive now, we have, we have flood the man the car with music coming down here. <laughs> 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 well, if I listen it's to the music, I'm so, I mean, for sure you probably never ever hear none of them there yet. No, we never. I listen to probably about 30 and something. Well, this is a drive for me, Yeah. As him says, a learning <laughs> process to me. Yeah. Mm. You understand? Know, we listen to all kinds of genre, but if you know, yeah. listen to your own music, you're not going to know your direction. Yeah. You have to know where you go. Yeah. Yeah, if I know what you do before. And that's yeah, why you have so much hip-hop sound and, and all sides are different sound now, are infiltrating the youth them music and them a think of dance all that. Because they're not even listening to the old know. school or the foundation of what it was. No, for them don't know what is dance They don't pay attention. Mm. Them not, them not even realize that most hip-hop artists, when, when them careers start going on a dance all, them, 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 them draw mm-hmm. from. Mm-hmm. Yeah. See me? Yeah. I'm going to put my mouth again when I talk. No, I'm not going to go away from you. See what I say? I mean, I know what I'm talking about. I see it all the time. Whether they want to acknowledge it or not, and mm-hmm. I know you get the respect where you're supposed to get either. Yeah. But then, you know, my main thing and my, my thing right now, more more create more on a social media. That's what I want to take our dance all thing now, where we know so we and, and people are we're interested in we and our thing come. We don't have no censorship to talk about the topics and what we want to talk about. Mm-hmm. And you see, them type of vibe because. People are censor our thing, people are use our thing, and people now get our thing the credit where it's supposed to get and the respect. We can't look it from them if I take it for ourselves. Mm. Yeah, we need to yeah. bust down some more barriers, you know? Yeah. yeah. A yeah. long time the journey depends on the road, you know? I know. We're still have trouble coming out. Build start. something so tall, the barrier can't even make no sense. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Yo, you know, we always wonder when we sit down and talk to the great ones. You're still as excited for create music today as you were back then? Yeah, we just dropped in a Miami yesterday. We reached out the up by, by the time of the land. <laughs> for vice for a youth, I don't know. Yeah. Where I don't get a dollar from him. Yeah. I don't have nothing at all. I just have a vice for a song for the culture. Yeah. Yeah, man, I'm excited about it. And it's still there like that. 100%. Yes, Every day, all day, man. Right yeah, there, yeah, I'm going to DJ, just cock up on him here. Boom, boom, boom. It's a joke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going on it. It's amazing. You say you draw the line there a while ago, and it just goes to show how yeah. in depth. Sometimes you're not a dancer, yeah. and you listen to a song, and just the, you just you know the vibe. But when you sit down and dissect, you know and what I mean. You're the person. And I say. you're the person yeah. I say. And a Come little on. lectures making my daughter, 19 year old now, yeah. and a dancer, me a drive. I just sang your talk, brother. 
Trust me, she said to me one time, said, boy, why not call the name of the person that must say, well, mm-hmm. but you have a song where I'm saying, no, nah, no responsibility, no responsible, not a mm-hmm. baby mother for it. Lose yeah. the chance, you don't have no yeah. responsibility. Yeah. So you live your life freely. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. But through the tunes are bad. You just sing on a Bobby and I enjoy it, not realizing how much. Mm-hmm. Again, it goes back to lyricism. Yeah. The message. Yeah. I love it, I love it, I love it. Now, I'm sure you have a hard drive somewhere with some Sprago you're not going to release to the world, but me never hear a Sprago, I'm going like it. Me, never, me, me can't answer, me never hear a Tantum, I'm going to like it. Talk to me about the last tips, the hard drive with the Sprago, I'm going to hear, I'm going to hear. How critical are you of your yeah. own work when you hear it back? I'm going to hear, eh, eh. I'm extremely critical, and like I said, so critical that if I'm going to like it, I'm not even going to record it. Mm. I waste a time and energy that, because if I'm going to write it, I'm supposed to laugh. Mm. If I'm going to laugh, the song no bad. Yeah. <laughs> 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 but now I record this. This is going to wait until another time. Yeah. yeah. You know, I force nothing. No, I want any time I write a song and done. I suppose you can go up on the stage and perform it. Mm-hmm. And if you don't feel it like that, then from inception, yeah. it ain't going to happen. Yeah. I love that. I love that. I love that. The, the, there's something I, I've seen, and again, I won't ever call names because I'm still fans of most people's work, some works. I know artists who they've had such a potent catalog of music and then there came a time when it just starts to the decline and we all have our assumptions it kind of okay is it a money thing okay mr go find an album for the producer yeah you know what i'm saying and our man come and say yo me get 10 grand do this boom 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 but it kind of start water down the catalog i don't i've noticed that you put out music selectively i want to put out music selectively it's not on every friday mm-hmm. mega say one sprag a, a drop a road one tanta metro and a drop a road how damaging to the culture, to the music, is music being so disposable? I remember putting out a, an album and I sent out the single. And by me send the song out Monday, the DJ said to him, bad. By the following Monday, he might ask me for a new tune. Right? Mm-hmm. How important is it that we control that, regulate that versus making disposable music? Or is it okay to just say, yo, if I have the energy, I have the vibe, I drop a tune every Friday? Yeah. What do you think? Well, some artists said they want to run the place. Mm. And you know, say people attention span short nowadays, you know. Mm. So as you said, the song come out yesterday and they might ask you, what you have new? Mm. You see me? But me have that yesterday. <laughs> yeah, man, but what you have new? Mm-hmm. So it's always about your creative capacity and your drive towards the thing, how much you love it or, or what you want to do. Me can just know, say, all right, I love the music and I don't really want to depend on everything because my, my quality control standards are so high. Mm-hmm. So I find something like, I like everything, I like everything, but I don't like them other four there. So I'm going to pick the best two out of the one that I like because mm-hmm. I don't want to oversaturate myself. Because mm-hmm. you're not in the stage for one try run place. But with a young artist, he must have to prove himself to the people and mm-hmm. say, I have this. Mm-hmm. You, see, you can't come give me one song and be no one hit wonder. So mm-hmm. Jamaican culture is different. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. And I like foreign where right? you sing your one song, you have your single, and you go about from the stage show, and then you sing your one song for the whole entire length of the song. <laughs> pan, 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 <laughs> top of the pops. Jamaica you know, at punchline. Yeah. I, I have, you see, it's, so, it's so spontaneous and so adrenaline driven. Mm-hmm. You know, it, 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 it can work both ways. It can work for you and it can work against you. Yeah. I got you, I got you, I got you. That being said, though, I mean, I speak for me, can we go through the catalog? I'm sitting, I'm listening to the music, them, yeah. right? Normally, when if you're an, an, a modern day artist, it and it's, and it's not dance, it's not like reggae, it's about artist, period. You know what I mean? When I go about our, 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 our genre, mm. when the artists that put out the songs as often as we're talking about right now, yeah. most of them with quality and quantity, they don't go together. Yeah. When enough quantity of music come out, yeah. right? The quality not really dead. I get one good, get yeah. five BS, I get one good. When me remember I chill out and I, and I hear a spraga drop, a spraga drop, let me say that's why it got to be a last tape somewhere because yeah. I can't go to the one where I ever said, why should I keep the one there? No? The one has the favorite. Well, you know the things I do because if from the first song it, mm-hmm. That means I'm going to deal with trash. So you know the formula. I don't have no baggage. I don't care baggage. I want every song when I sing, I want to you know, perform a song. All of them when I sing, as much as the people I'm like. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to make sure some I try and make songs that are not disposable. Mm. I got you. Yeah. I got you, I got you, I got you. Um, I had some conversations with some folks overseas, people who book the bands and people who, you know, whenever I'm there and I have the conversation, we always talk the culture. And they've said professionalism has always been something that was a little fleeting in the business. Right now, I'm impressed because when we say the young artists I'm at the right now is nothing short of amazing. You know, them I manage them, 
they might be a little arrogant, a little cocky, but they're managing things properly. You got musicians that are actually trained musicians coming out of schools, Edna's and other institutions. You have people having proper management who know what they're doing. How you feel about the future? All right, it's, it's just a matter of time before we all are sit down and a rocking chair and a watch them and I say, "Yo, the mute here." How you feel about the future of this culture? I mean, as a dancer, I reggae, our music. Are you comfortable with where you see the future going right about now? Or is a situation you look worried? Me? Both hell. Well, from what I observe, I see the youth them have structure because there was some failure in the past. Mm-hmm. You understand? And it, and it look like them have research. Mm-hmm. I know a lot of young youth that. I research the past. Mm-hmm. So, in order to not make that mistake, you know, mm-hmm. them start set up them, them house properly. Mm-hmm. You understand? Little PR, yeah, so little management, yeah, so little this, little that, you know? Mm-hmm. And they must structure them things. So, it's a good look. Mm-hmm. Them just need to keep to the family. Because sometimes them youth are just chip and gone somewhere else. <laughs> you know? you know? So, so yeah. as long as them keep to the family, yeah. and mm-hmm. them Success lead them astray. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes when you get too big in a business, you be like, you can't control, you can't talk to. Mm. You see the humbleness there? Mm-hmm. Carry through the journey. Yeah, yeah. And you never lose your way. Humble care of them, say? Do what they want, do what they milk. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, sample. How oh, you say this, brother? How you feel about it? How oh, you feel about it? Yeah, me, 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 like uh, alkaline, them you them I like how them do them thing. I like I like how popcorn are doing work. Structured. Yeah, yeah, you see me? me not for them, me not, me not really in with a lot of them songs, you know. Mm-hmm. But how oh, them approach the thing nowadays, I kind of like it. Mm-hmm. You know? I yeah. dig it. Yeah, them for just stick to the original roots of them thing and know say, this is for them culture and other people want it too. Right. Stop being the dog with the, 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 the bone in your mouth and look down at the water. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hey man, them inspire even me, so but yeah. before them. Yeah. Stop being a dog, yeah. Yeah, yeah, man. I yeah. got you. Mm. I got you. Ladies and gentlemen, whenever the opportunity presents itself to have them kind of conversation, I got to, all right? I love to learn, and I figure out who else can I learn from that those who have done it and done it well. Labels. I still do it. I still do it. You know what I'm saying? On the same level. Yeah. Cause what's impressive to me is that is you're going to come in and... It's a difference between, the, 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 and again, it goes right back to the, the concept of how things are created. It's like lab creations where they go into the studio and create a song. It may take you five days to create it, but really you spend half an hour and the engineer spend four and a half days. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Putting it together. So realistically, it's engineer featuring you instead of you really shut up on the thing. And then when time comes, forgot to the stage or perform the song or whatever, it just, you can't connect. Mm-hmm. When the, 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 the microphones fire up, I'm going to see you up on the microphone, the Michelle. All right, before it gets clear, <laughs> so we are cleaning it up, and, and and you guys go and and and, and Michelle and drop some tunes. It's just effortless. Me feel like when I could do the tune and I send a text same time. You know what I mean? And it comes out just the same way how me get it on a CD, right? But most times with the younger artists, it doesn't work that way because there's not a lot of creation that's done that's not on the work of the engineer. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Art of tune and and melody and all sort of different technologies are come out now. Don't permit the artist to come up on stage and perform the same thing live with the same sound mm-hmm. because so much padding going on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I go up on it. You see? And I like back in the days, I don't know, say, a 20 away in the studio and a, a, a 16 track, you know. Not true, man. <laughs> so <laughs> it's a, it's a, it's a the one track, when you have one track come up, you have to shut from that and everything. You see? So all of the talent, the right, that's in yeah. the vocalist there. Yeah. You see me? And I like the engineer, you know. All the engineers have to do a balance with him and then get everybody voice. But nowadays, you must have going on all different type of plugins mm-hmm. and all that stuff. You have to try to get a little sound. To get a nice so sound. That's the difference with it still. Engineer work well, hard yeah, already. Engineer, so I just say, go back straight back to how we learn the thing. Yeah. Yeah, we learn it around sound system, man. I'm saying, I had to tune the band. <laughs> the sound system, you know. You go out there in a sound, yeah, one of the people them look at you like, they must say, oh, I want to do stone him. <laughs> <laughs> and they will do it. They're not just thinking it either. Sometimes they shun the back of the deal things. Okay. <laughs> mm. Labels, we don't have much of that. We've had, I think, 
the issue with reggae music, we always talk about why are we not getting the commercial viability that we. I want to say commercial. It's not about money coming in a pocket and everything. You know? I'm talking about just being on the platforms and being respected. Correct me if I'm wrong. I've always felt like hip hop, R&B, a lot of them genre they were created on commercialism. In other words, from the inception, man, a rap about party and girl and car and, and, and bling bling, right? Mm -mm. Whereas I disagree. You disagree with that? Yeah. Go on, who, because uh, from basically from the inception and mm -hmm. no because Cool Herc and, uh, and Jungle mm -hmm. Brothers and all them people then they didn't rap Queen Latifah then they didn't rap about True. consciousness. Well, I retract back in other days. True. Yeah. Even two pack them. Yeah. I'm pack and Biggie. Mm -hmm. I, I, when Jay Z and of them brother come in you know, and then the that Flats generation and, and the flats and start. They, they start yeah and the cash they, money they turn up yeah lord lord yeah, lord lord yeah, lord, yeah. lord. Mm -hmm. but reggae started out and let me take out the word start out reggae has mostly grown on the whole peace oh, and peace love and, and love vibe love. and mm -hmm. just blessings and whatever the case may be is freedom. it freedom is it safe to say that being that these genres are coming up in them lanes is kind of a reason why we can't ever expect reggae to be as commercial as any of them there. Or is it possible for reggae to be as commercial as an R&B as a, as a, as a hip hop? Marketing do anything, you know. Oh, you have the proper marketing, you, know. you can go through and break mm -hmm. in the barrier. Mm -hmm. Marketing do it for real. Market. Yeah. We don't have the marketing structure. And there. we have to understand mm -hmm. too, say agendas exist. You know, whether we want to acknowledge it or accept it or not, agendas do exist to lift one and push down one. Mm -hmm. So if, if you get music, are the, are the music where open people eyes and lift up people. And, and, and the system agenda is for don't press people and keep people in bondage and you have a different genre of music where I do that, where I, where I distract people they're going to push that genre of music mm -hmm. over the one that open people's eyes or, or get people conscious mm -hmm. so that's the, the, the struggle where reggae music face so it never really going to be commercial because it lick out against people with thin skins mm -hmm. so me, and when we don't talk people bruise up <laughs> when fire don't blaze people yes, cook people, up. Well, people cook when, 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 when our fire them start blazing <laughs> Yeah, but they don't know who do why you're the They want to feel comfortable in, in yeah. their doings. Yeah, yeah. You know, they don't want to mm -hmm. feel them color, sweat up because the person just says something. Mm -hmm. Words do hit you other than bricks. Mm -hmm. And people are listening. Yeah. And all along, the words go deep. You know, your father ever don't beat you yet and they just say something and you go sit down and bow. My mother. My mother. I might, yeah, I my right. mother said something about one time. And my father that yeah. was. Yeah? You know? Just say yeah. a word. Just say what you say. Mm -hmm. And you not even get beaten. Yeah. And you wish him to beat you. Yeah, yeah. I bet they didn't get beaten. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But know exactly so where you do cut deep, you see And then yes, reaching yeah. a places where you can't, you can't hide. Because what are you going to do? You're going to your phone over your ears every day when a car blast. Mm. You see me? So I better them try to suppress the music fully. And don't right. get it played in a, in a certain arena where it's going to reach the masses. So it don't seem commercial. But as I said before, every time they want something for rally back pan, mm -hmm. reggae music or dance or music, I say, Oh, we have this hot reggae song. And it's a big thing to have a reggae song. Yeah, yeah. Why? If yeah. it's not commercially viable. If people don't love it, why are the biggest thing for them when they have a reggae song? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mm -hmm. feel you. Biggest mm -hmm. thing for them, they don't want to be the biggest thing for we. Yeah. Because yeah, when see. they control it, like yeah. I said, agendaism is at play. Agendaism. Them dictate what yeah. go out. True, exactly. true. And even our, our, our entities that are supposed to push the music out, the radio stations, mm. right? The, the, the radio stations, the so called labels, and all them looking things. Me yeah. personally feel say, them probably they don't like me, can be about not fire or right? yeah. I feel like they drop the ball and how we do what we do. You know what I mean? Yeah, because they might deal with a corporate world. Mm -hmm. So you can't really, you can't fight them in the car. They're in a corporate world for make, business, for make money. Mm -hmm. And the labels are spend money. And the little, the little smaller independents not spend money. So I'm going to play with the label, the bigger label push to them. Mm -hmm. So up to the, the people I'm like you now and the selector them will love our genre mm -hmm. for push where the, the, the mainstream now play. Mm -hmm. Because we know the real talent and the real people them. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. You can't make, and because we have follow what the radio station do, then the things start get watered down and start get journey. Mm -hmm. You know, start get away because the radio play for it commercial thing and then I get a, the same song yeah, 10 times for the day mm -hmm. because of that, you see me? Yeah, uh, like the yeah. dancehall thing where you know say, yeah, yeah, some. So the thing, it, it, it just set away, yeah, man. We just have to continue to do what we do if we love what we do. Yeah. You go right back to agenda, is it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I got you. Netflix. 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 Hmm? The music Netflix. I see you're so saying you know, this Netflix, mm -hmm. Netflix music. <laughs> No, I true, I true. And, and it's like it, it goes right back to what you say. A lot of we we control the creation, mm -hmm. but we've got zero control over the distribution. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't matter what you make, you could be selling crack, clothes, houses, or music. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? If you make it and you're not control how it goes out there, it either goes out yeah. or it doesn't. Yeah. And nine times out of ten, if you're not control it, 
Yeah. Then it doesn't. That's why we don't tell people as I said earlier on, who want to own a social media outlets, but not only that, we don't want to own a streaming. We want to own everything, we just dance and me. Just like how Jay-Z them have Tidal and whatever them have, we mm. want our own. We <coughs> need to have them things that too. Uh, it's what we do, we don't have no music, we don't have no, we don't have no, no, no foundation then. Is that possible? Bob Marley did that. Oh, you mean if it's possible? Mm. Bob Marley come make tough, tough gang mm. and did a call in all of the artists them mm. in the Jamaica and did a deal with them distribution and everything and cut out who for cut out and put in who for put in. It can be, it so can it's, be it's done. So it's very doable? Yeah, I just nowadays a, a technology so you have to move with you know, mm-hmm. the, the, the new ways of doing things. Right, Get right. some youth interested and educated and, you know, start from this. Uh, mm. Looking for the next generation coming in, you know, so they have yeah. them own thing for yeah. build. That's a good idea. Yeah. 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 We can't live off a of them system. No. We can't depend on them for giving or just yeah, we get cents or a fraction of a cent pan. A of play. a fraction. You, you see me? Mm. You know what I you see what I talk about? So how we are going to reach for that? The labels are going to reach for them thing there. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because the they always have you in a, in a, in a, in a recruitment and in a rage and all sort of things. Somebody always have something to take from you as an artist. Mm-hmm. So, and then the educate artists like that. And it's not for them to educate artists. It's not for, for us to educate our own selves and yeah. each other. Mm-hmm. But still, them in the business, we do it. Them for do some more for, for, for make yeah. sure so everybody happy mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and comfortable. Then, you know, people work better than we are. Them can eat, we can eat. And if that now happen, then we need to do it for ourselves. That, but that, that requires some unity. How unified are yeah. we as a culture? It can happen, as I said, because I remember even before Budget did go in, mm. in the, uh, a, a thing where we start, where we have meetings up a, up a, up a Carlisle every week mm-hmm. and talk about issues and all them things. It can happen. Not just people yeah. need for, for, you know, spirit certain things. I love that. I love that. And I love, I love there's two things let me hear where really mean a lot to me. One is the unification process because a lot of times we, we, we the youth that we say is that it's something that's taught. This yeah. unity is something that's taught. And, and they're generational things where we pass down bad things, right? Yeah. But anytime we talk to people like yourselves and you say unity is important, then that's valuable information that's trickling down to them. Because what I realize with these youths pretty much is they may give off the arrogance and act like they're not listening. Yeah. But they do pay attention. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? They might be too arrogant for your credit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But they do pay attention. Yeah, I don't so, think that... You know? Yeah. Some love it when 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 Una says stuff like that because I think that definitely will trickle down to them. Um, mm-hmm. As I talk to the youth, them to them say sometimes like there's a rift between the elders them and them because them feel like them not getting the ratings from the elders and the elders them feels that them not, them, them, them 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 you know them not respect them elders. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? There's always that little thing I go on. The generation before I always looked up on the one after, and the generation now I always feels that like the one above them burned on the house. Honestly, me yeah. not have the problem there with the youth them still know. Mm-hmm. So me now go me now go join another part there for say that is how it goes. Some other artists might have that mm-hmm. because of how them them personalities are. Mm. But me not have the problem with the youth. Them. None of the youth them never disrespect me yet. Yeah. All of them come to me. Uh, uh, not all of them, but a lot of them do come to me after hearing and ask opinion. Mm-hmm. And me hear a lot of them in you know, them songs give out respect all sorts of ways. So I don't no really see the youth them mm-hmm. a violator. I see them watch, we, me, and I can see enough things in, a, in enough elder artists, in enough youth when they perform. So I can say, Johnny, you know, say, I know where that comes from. Mm-hmm. You know, and I, so they, as I said, the youth them pay attention to. Yeah. They might not want to come give all of the credit because they don't know how you are going to take it. Mm-hmm. You know? And some yeah, people man. don't take it well. No. Even though I credit it again, I'm going to say, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> so, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it does come down to the person. But me personally, I have the problem with the youth, them still. Uh, yeah, yeah. Them. yeah, and the youth, they remember it. They, they, I'm going to get ratings from them. them. Yeah. You give yeah. ratings so you get it. Yeah. I'm going to talk to even Yellowstone yesterday. We had a, line, a nice conversation and to how him speak about, you know, you two gentlemen and how to embrace him coming in. Because at the end of the day, everybody of them career for put on the line. Yeah. So mm-hmm. you're not going to end us. It's not always the easiest thing or the greatest thing for end us. Somebody who not really have it that way there, talent wise yeah. and believe me every artist feels that them have it that way yeah. there and some don't you know what I mean but what them need a lot of time is strength and I feel like you know I don't know if it's people worried about somebody taking their space but I realize that owner have no problem saying you're confident in who you are so you don't have the problem say you here's the knowledge here's the advice what me have for you versus what I'm in the no no well, everybody have a space, you know. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Air can, you can't, you yeah. can't breathe in all of the air around you. You can't live on all of the land. Yeah. Every, every, everybody have them space to this. So. <laughs> and it hey. can't done. No, no, no. Maybe me fool fool. <laughs> but if me see artist boss today, mm-hmm. me feel so good for him. I yeah. mean, man. Real good. Yeah. Me always, maybe I say me go up and listen to music. Yeah, yeah. And when me start making music, me, it's a joy to me. So, if you know, say, I'm a meat stopper. 
Yeah. And yeah. it continues. And some of them make music with sweet me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, I like hear it, man. I need for fun. I dig it. Cycle, right? I don't need to teach one like a baby with band music. Cool, man. Go, go, ga, ga. You know them style there. Like. <laughs> In the yes, yeah. Go, 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 ga, ga. Go, go, ga. I know why they do that right now. <laughs> Clean up on there. What me say? That's a goo goo gaga. What me say? Them goo 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 gaga. Better them goo goo gaga. Lyricism at its finest. Yo, we don't have to get about a year now, so I guess what, I feel like it's only right. One of them days we get to sit down with one on one and have a reasoning. You know what I mean? Even outside of these walls, but I've learned so much. I you know the massive and crew watching right now have learned a lot from you. At the end of the day, when Spraga decides to jump in a spaceship and fly off in a sunset, right? Mm -hmm. What do you want people to take from the work that you've given to them so far? Well, no, I want them to take from it really, you know. Whatever it is, I want. Just take what you want. Listen, me, Gia, you take what you want. Take what you want, man. Feel free, man. <laughs> Some people like, get a good message from it, and some people like, say, Yo, me a bad boy, and some people say, You know, say, but this thing is nice. Everybody, everybody will get something, yeah, and yeah. Yeah. get the, whatever it is, them choose from it. Mm -hmm. A reward will come, a, a, a part will come, a, a judgment will come. From where them come, where them take from it, you know. Mm. But for you, more of them take the good part, them really do. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I dig it, ladies and gentlemen. It is Tanta and Devante. It is Yellowstone. It is Sprague Benz. Drop some social media for the masses and keep up. You know? I know, saying really to mess with it, but yes. you got one. Three though. Sprague Benz three. Yeah. Sprague Benz with a number three at the end. Mm. Yeah. Twitter and IG. Uh, Sprague Benz. Uh, YouTube and and Facebook. So you name Sprague Benz. Sprague Benz is not just a Sprague Benz is a unique name. So you tell me, say two people take Sprague Benz before you. Yeah man, enough Spraga Benz out there man, but when you look and I, I, I can't check to the numbers yeah, 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 yeah. the followers are what you can't check the numbers, that one here, that one here There's a weird thing where they go try to get yeah. your own name and a man, a man grab it up Yeah man, uh, man, the other day Facebook kicked me off of Facebook <laughs> For my own name you know, and, and, and scammer still left and the thing is Spraga where I take people money and all sorts of things you know, and them kick off me Yeah The man there You don't know IG, Tanta Metro and Devante, Facebook Tanta Metro and Devante Twitter, Tante Mitchell, Devon. You don't know. You can You have the. What you call it? Tante Website. Metro vibes. No, yeah, yeah. Tante Metro Vibes. No, Mark Tante Metro Vibes. For IG. Yeah. Yeah. Man, I've been more things. You yeah. don't remember it, bro. That's <laughs> Google. Yeah. Google. Google. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Google will take you there. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yellowstone. Straight there. What the people can find you? Yeah, Yellowstone Music, you know, IG, and Facebook. Mm -hmm. Twitter, Yellowstone one, and I mean, and YouTube, I still Yellowstone. Right. Uh, I'm there. I love it. I love it. Love it. Ladies and gentlemen, it has been a pleasure for me. I know it has been a pleasure for you too. What we're gonna do right about now is we're gonna pull out the good china. All right, the artists them are gonna go into some tune. Just gonna look a little snippet of what go on little more. Make sure you meet us out at the garden. As a matter of fact, me have a fly. I'ma drop the thing by you. I'ma say, wait, there, wait, there, wait, there, wait, there it is. Uh, yep, 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 yep. Tanta Metron and Devante, Spraga Benz, Yellowstone, Quartered. Today is Saturday, June 22nd. It's going down tonight. Yeah. All right? Oh, I, I, I got a question. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> well, we can ask um, Tanta Metron and Devante a question. Yeah. We we'll ask, ask them, like, because probably most people outside probably want to know this, like, mm -hmm. what caused them to stay so long to get and together? Because as a duo, Mm -hmm. If there's enough to come up and they fall apart and then you hear about them again mm -hmm. But these two legends keep on going and they're always together Because every time I see them, I always see them together yeah. I'm a group, listen to these That's a great like, question, and just for, for the masses who can't hear him The question really is How they manage to stay together so long? You have people who can't be married for so long <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? You have countries that have separated You know, yes. you know what I'm saying? Now Europe for less, for shorter time and that. How to manage it? It's so outside of music. Mm -hmm. We're a real friend. Yeah. You understand? And we can talk about <coughs> our faults. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand? If you make a mistake, we talk to him. Yeah. If I make a mistake, him talk to me. Mm -hmm. You understand? So we have to just be real to each other. Mm -hmm. And that keep we through this journey. Yeah. We're just real to each other. And we are good friends outside of music. Go on like him not there. You can't actually obligated to do this to ain't you? 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that to be true. I'm a blood man. I'm a blood. <laughs> me know, we start him one day, I trust me, him express the love and, and, and trust me. Yeah, man, the feeling mutual. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm a brother, I'm a, I'm a big brother still. Yeah. I'm still at 25 still, but then got one. I celebrate him 25th, look like more. No, me at 25, I'm a busy boy. That's some of Cool, no, man. A good boy, though. I love it, I love it, I love it. Ladies and gentlemen, again, thank you so much. Uh, who else? Carolyn, Donald, Jarico, a million people who are logged in right now watching. And again, I want to bless other people listening via radio. Mm-hmm. All right, again, hop on to justmusic.com, like more, um, forward slash JMTV. This is going to be up there. But again, if you're not dead there tonight, call a spade a spade, you whack. You know what I mean? If you're not dead there tonight, I'll go and enjoy the vibe with us. You have to go wait till next year. Kind of, kind of whack. You have to go wait till next birthday, don't you? Next one. See there? Or maybe it's probably birthday I come up and we can read the thing. God, I ain't going to say it. It's even worse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Brace comes to Musical Tinkle. I'm talking about the real thing. We are all a vibe song the lead. You see it. Time to make sure. And the fun thing. What? I'm talking about the real thing So what? Uh, if you swim me on the corner You knock a little game With some real rasta man with fame Call us the small train Small train, small train If you smell it in the air Yes, you will feel it in your vein Lift you up like a brand new plane Call me the small train Small train, small train Oh, they bring it come now Give me some my grace sitting for me lungs now Come me quick off it pass it until it done now And me quick load it back up with the gum now Chalice off it bun now Beat come go jump now Music and I grace sitting now with fun now oh, Watch the Eden fall about them a run now Meditation higher than the sun now Yo, what's how we think up? If you swim me on the corner, you knock a little game with some real rasta man with fame. Call us the small train, small train, small train. If you smell it in the air, yes, you will feel it in your vein. Lift you up like a brand new plane. Call me the small train, small train. And this one, ladies and gentlemen, is one of the latest joints from Tanta Metro and Devante. It's called Smoke Train, and it comes to you from their latest album, Reganometrist. It's a big one, it's a bad one, it's a tough one. Make sure you go ahead and get it, all right? And this one is one of the latest joints from Spraga Benz. It's called Different. Make sure you go ahead and pick this one up, all right? Keep it moving, keep it grooving. It is homegrown. Yeah, that's how we do it. It's me, Spraga B, alongside Tad Latte. Yeah. And you see what me I say? Them not there when me there, no time Eh, yeah. why? Because me differ, me think just differ Just differ, my style just differ Me just differ, my song just differ My flex just differ, the rest just differ My sharp and richer, my thing just differ Me just differ, my style just differ Me just differ, my song just differ My flex just differ, the thing just differ Well, in the liver, when I met differ I with her first smell like an angel with her Me think ever miss her, she just look prettier Than anything that me ever seen in a picture Have that whipper, her eyes are deeper From ties her hipper, design just fit her So, me pick her, remove her knicker Give her that dicker, pleasure come quicker Because me different the thing just differ, just differ, my style just differ, just differ, my song just differ, the flex just differ, the rest just differ, my sharp and richer, my style just differ, just differ, my thing just differ, just differ, my song just differ, the flex just differ, the thing just differ. Well, me no quarrel, no me no bicker, me don't smoke no far abuse or liquor, me use Facebook and me like IG, me no like Snapchat, but me cool with Twitter. Power with Amla, me power with bitter, so sicker. All us are hard bitters, and when we arrive, enough of them get jitters because them nervous. Be a chat cheater. No, your girl, my you, what's with her? She just can't move like the me permit her. She don't want to stop like the love bug beat her. She acting hot like me lighter wicker. Was not herself till she got my sneaker. We're not that close and she want me kiss her. She cry Spraga to the bends differ. And there you have it. Thank you so much for tuning in. It has indeed been a pleasure. Please be sure to subscribe to the podcast, Homegrown with G. Cole, now available on Radio.com, iTunes, Google Play, Stitcher, TuneIn, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and all your podcast platforms. Please check out the website, homegrownwithgcole.com, to listen and for all things Homegrown. To watch the video of this interview, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, Homegrown with G. Cole. Remember, be safe, be kind, and be good to each other. My name is G. Cole, and this is Homegrown. Nakikinika sa musica, Homegrown with G. Cole. Estás escuchando Homegrown con G. Cole. 您现在正在收听的是 
Homegrown with G. Cole. You're listening to Homegrown with G. Cole. Remember, all the music played here on the podcast Homegrown with G. Cole is available on iTunes, Spotify, and all your digital retailers. Please support the artists.